Unfortunately, lots of people do that and they don't care. Whoops. Alright, Chambers of the Human Skull. Ooh. You're learning about all sorts of horrible things, aren't you? What's with the tools you're using? Yeah, I'm not sticking around. What the hell is that? Whatever. I'm not sticking around to find out. Alright. It's kind of creepy. Alright, it's more than just a little creepy. Seriously, shut up! <gasps> ah, you son of a bitch! Put them in a safer place, seriously, Alexander. So I suppose it wasn't just animals you were hurting, eh? Uh, why is that there? Is that supposed to be a penis because it doesn't look like one? One moment. Oh, okay, I've got to read this. 1958, January 9th. Further disappointment. The antiquarian's latest findings yielded nothing. I'm still unable to grasp the inner workings of life and its relation to the power I sense within it. I shall pursue more books on the subject, but I suspect it will be in vain. Since no research has been made in my particular interest, I must attempt to fill that void myself. Clearly humans em emanate more of the energy I seek. But I hope animals will suffice as they provide less of a hassle to acquire. Alright, you're trying to understand life out now, are you? By cutting things up. You're trying to understand life by killing. Alright. This, this Alexander dude is a cunt. Ooh. Uh, Canis Lupus Familiaris. <coughs> Sorry about that. After a short study, it is clear that the agitation found among humans can be found in the dog. Fear and pain induce stress which seems to trigger an endogenous response, causing the animal to burst with energy. I believe that the catalyst is produced in the brain. It is difficult to determine exactly where and what it is, but I can sense it. It reeks of cosmic genesis. There is an inherent problem in harvesting this energy since the creature is bound to die from the exercise. I must refine this process of torture to enable my real work, any real work to be done. More experiments must be performed, but it seems that the only human beings are being are ab only human beings are able to produce the amount necessary. It might be their ability to appreciate the severity of the process that ultimately augments their experience of terror. So you're torturing things. I can only guess what these might be for. Like cutting off penises much? Wake up! One moment. Let's give you a proper burial. There you go. You get... You can thank me later. Get out of the way. Um. Ah, 
I know most people wouldn't suggest doing such things. Have it, come on. Come on. I got more sanity pack for breaking a window. What's that sound? It's that stuff. Well, I was going insane there. Elevator re 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 renovation plans are gears. All right, what's this? Hey! When will it be my turn? Have I not shown restraint? My patience spans centuries from where I came. Mankind is not even a wasted, wasted a breath. Yet I bow to you. I have done so much for you and I have gained nothing in return. Agrippa, I trusted you. It was I who in all fairness should have entered that gate. <laughs> all right, fair enough. Well, you're showing patience, are you? Really? You think so, do you? Oh. I won't be needing that. No, trust me, I don't need this. Hey! Come on. Out you go. Well, you said you wanted some renovation done, Alexander. Alexander, do you have enough bucks? I mean, really. Not even the biggest no-lifer to books, my girlfriend, could have this many. Hey, what the frickin'... Fair enough. Come on, this isn't the time for playing tricks. Whatever. If the elevator breaks down again, make sure to use the steam engine to build up pressure before challenging it into the machinery. Adjust the levers to get the right amount of pressure inside the chamber. The meters should read up. Uh, read up 8 and down 8. Make sure the flow is set according to the following chart. Trinity steam set functions for phase altitude amplitude complete steam flow cycle. Note that the machine will not check proper configuration until all rods are inserted. Whatever that means. Well, this is a rod. That's what she said. This is a rod. Hmm. Hey, come on. That was hard to open. I meant char. I guess we're heading back now. Um, what the frick was that? Guys, what am I seeing? Have it. This game's weird, really. Can 
I'm still in need of a key. He flipped through the Book of Monarchs looking for etchings and counted. Nine different kings from all over Europe have been depicted with an orb resting in their hands. Maybe it was their balls. What so far? I don't know where I'm going. Oh, this way. Storage! Sir William Smith had been marked. There was no way for him to know that the young man from the other day cast such a terrible shadow. Because, of course, he was a very, very gay man. It sure is dark in here. Yes, that is a good reason for it. Arr, me hearty, there would be a good reason for this darkness, arr. I'll not tell you what that be, but I'll tell you a good reason for it. I get the feeling there's going to be lots of enemies here. That kind of scared the crap out of me. <laughs> yeah. Well, I've been going on long enough with this for now. So I will see you the next time when I kick this thing's ass with a barrel. Goodbye. <laughs>